This is a Colorado baker out of Denver. Yes. All, hail the, all hail the liberals. So the Colorado baker refused to make a custom cake because they wanted this two guys kissing, you know. They wanted this LGBT gay whatever. Right, and so he said no. He says, no, there's a baker across the street. He'll do a great job for you. Well, these people, he had a sincere belief that, that the Bible is correct. <gasps> oh, my! So, the courts, which are ruling for Satan, decided to challenge it. So, Jack Phillips got backed by some law firm, and uh, he said, well, we ought to follow the Bible. Well, like anybody in a government's going to believe that. So, the dispute, this is 2012. Mm -hmm. So, these two gays were set in by the CIA, their intelligence officers. Okay, they weren't just two gay people. They were sent in to destroy Baker and bring this corpse to the Supreme Court. Everything that happens in politics is pre-planned. Everything. Remember, the Supreme Court hasn't met since January of, two, of this year. So, the dispute led to the ruling began in 2012 when Charlie Craig and David Mullins, two intelligence agencies, went to a masterpiece cake shop, a bakery just outside Denver, to order a cake to celebrate their upcoming wedding. Well, the guy said, no, I'm not going to bake this cake unless you allow me to bake it in a traditional wedding, and then you can put the two men on top kissing. Well, the intelligence agency said, fine, we'll take you to court. So they recorded it all, finally went to court, and the Supreme Court ruled. And so ready? after it's been how many years now, and it's finally gone to yeah, the Supreme and, Court. And how many, how many cases do the intelligence people present to the Supreme Court and they're ruled on in a month. It's been seven years, eight, nine years, and the Supreme Court ruled you have the right not to bake the cake. And here's why. Because in part of the briefing that the CIA received, because remember, the Supreme Court is disbanded. Congress is disbanded. The Office of the President is disbanded. They're all running a false government out of Fort McPherson. We don't have a government. So, the CIA was told, if you rule that this man has to bake cake for their gay wedding, that means that the KKK can ask a black seamstress to make uniforms for them. Now think about that for a minute. That means that I can go down to Georgia and ask any company that does custom sewing work to make me KKK uniforms, and they can't deny me. That's right. So the Supreme Court said... He ruled in favor of the baker. They, they gulped, and they thought about this for seven years, and they finally came up with a ruling. Somebody came up with a ruling, because, again, the drawings of the Supreme Court are fake. And out there, Jane, you can look at the uh, cameras. There's no cars at the Supreme Court. So these drawings of the Supreme Court heads just sitting there, the, these drawings are fake. Because they haven't met in seven, you know, they haven't met in, let's see, January, February, March, April, May, six months. So, um, the CIA ruled that they don't have to bake a cake, which means if you're black, you don't have to make uniforms for the KKK. 